Hello friends, welcome back. Hearty welcome to you. Let us look at this problem. Find k so that x square plus 2x plus k is a factor of 2x to the power of 4 plus x cube minus 14x square plus 5x plus 6. Also find the zeros of the two polynomials. So we know x square plus 2x plus k is a factor of this. That means when we do long division, we should get the remainder as 0. So I'll equate the remainder to 0 and we'll find out the value of k. Then substituting in the quotient, we should be able to find out the all the zeros of the two poly, all the two two polynomials or the zeros of the polynomials. So let's go ahead now and try to do the long division here. We'll write down x square plus 2x plus k x square plus 2x plus k we want to divide dividend is 2x to the power of 4 plus x cube minus 14x square plus 5x plus 6 Let's do the division. So we know that first 2x to the power of 4 by x square I have to do. Leftmost I have to divide and I know that is 2x square. So I'll write down 2x square. 2x square into x square is 2x to the power of 4. Then 2x square into 2x is 4x cube. After that 2x square into k equal to plus 2kx square. Now we'll try to sub subtract this. We will change the signs. 2x to the power 4 will cancel. We are left out with 1 minus 4 minus 3x cube. Then we have minus of 14 plus 2k into x square. So we will add the next term that is 5x. Now we have to divide again the leftmost terms that is minus 3x cube divided by x square that will be minus 3x. Now let's multiply again minus 3x into x square minus 3x cube minus 3x into plus 2 that is equal to minus 6x square minus 3x into plus k that is minus 3kx. Let's go to the next step. When we go to the next step, we'll change the signs. Before that, we'll cancel them we will have minus of 14 minus 2k that will be minus 14 plus 6 that is minus of 8 plus 2k into x square plus 5 plus 3k into x let us get the next term that is 6 now the next term we have to go for that. So we have to divide the leftmost that is minus of 8 plus 2k x square by x square. So that will be minus of 8 plus 2k. So let's multiply with that. We will have minus 8 plus 2k into x square. So that will be minus 8 plus 2k into x square. Then we will have minus 2 into 8 that is 16, 2 into 2 that is 4, so it will be minus 16 plus 4k into x, after that we will have min minus plus into minus minus 8k, we can write it as minus of 8k minus 2 k square or I can take minus out then it will be 2k square plus 8k. Okay. Now this is the last step. So we will write down plus. We will cancel this. We will make it plus. We will make it plus. What we have let us see. We have 7k plus 21 into x. Then we have plus 2k square plus 8k plus 6 as the remainder. But we know both of them are equal to 0. Now let us do that. First we will do 7k plus 21 equal to 0. That will give you k equal to minus 3. The other one is 2k square plus 8k plus 6 equal to 0. 
now divide by 2 we get k square plus 4k plus 3 equal to 0 which is equal to k plus 1 into k plus 3 equal to 0 that means k equal to minus 3 is common in both of them so we know then k equal to minus 3 so once we know k equal to minus 3 we can substitute and we can get all the zeros of the two polynomials so let's go ahead and do the next step we have x square plus 2x plus k k is minus 3 we know that we know k equal to minus 3 so x square plus 2x minus 3 equal to 0 is our divisor and our quotient is 2x square minus 3x minus of 2k plus 8 equal to 0 let us simplify that that is 2x square minus 3x minus of 2k 2 into minus 3 minus 6 minus 6 plus 2 is minus 6 plus 8 I'll write down minus 6 plus 8 that is equal to 2x square minus 3x 8 minus 6 is 2 so we have minus 2 equal to 0 Let's go ahead and find out the zeros of this x square plus 2x minus 3 can be written as x square plus 3x minus x minus 3 equal to 0 can I write it as x into x plus 3 minus 1 into x plus 3 equal to 0 that means x plus 3 into x minus 1 equal to 0 which means x equal to minus 3 or x equal to 1 let's go to the next one the next one we have is 2x square minus 3x minus 2 2x square minus 3x minus 2 here sum is minus 3 and product is minus 4 so can I write it as minus 4 plus 1 2x square minus 4x plus x minus 2 can I take 2x common 2x into x minus 2 plus 1 into x minus 2 equal to 0 or can I write it as x minus 2 into 2x plus 1 equal to 0 or can I say that x equal to 2 or x equal to minus 1 by 2 so we got all the four zeros of the two polynomials all the zeros of the two polynomials so let's go ahead and write them the zeros of x square plus 2x plus k where k becomes minus 3 or minus 3 comma 1 and the zeros of 2x square minus 3x minus of 2k plus 8 where this whole thing will become 2 that is 2x square minus 3x minus 2 the zeros are 2 and minus 1 by 2 so k value is equal to minus 3 and the zeros of divisor and quotient are minus 3 comma 1 and 2 comma minus 1 by 2 so which are the zeros of the given polynomial 2x to the power of 4 plus x cube minus 14x square plus 5x plus 6 so let's have a recap of this particular problem what we have been asked what we did we have been asked to find out the value of k so that x square plus 2x plus k is a factor of 2x to the power of 4 plus x cube minus 14x square plus 5x plus 6 we have to also find out the zeros of the two polynomials so what we did since we don't know the divisor completely we have k there so we did long division and we try to find out the remainder equated it to 0 because x square plus 2x plus k is a factor when by factor theorem we know if it is a factor then the remainder is 0 now we equated the two terms whatever I got to equal to 0 we got k equal to minus 3 then we went and substituted in the divisor and the quotient divisor becomes x square plus 2x minus 3 equal to 0 whose factorization after factorization the zeros are minus 3 and and 1 now let's look at the quotient we have 2 x square minus 3 x minus 2 equal to 0 and the 
zeros are 2 and minus 1 by 2. So the zero of the zeros of the two polynomials are minus 3 comma 1 and 2 comma minus 1 by 2 which are also the zeros of the product of these two that is 2x to the power of 4 plus x cube minus 14x square plus 5x plus 6. So that's one interesting example I just thought of sharing with you. Please do let me know your feedback. Thanks for your time and support. Bye for now.